when I was growing up, so what did you want to be? And the astronaut was the first idea. And I realized since I don't like heights, that might not be the way to go. But I always tended to be strong in the maths and sciences. And when it came to wanting to find out what type of an engineer I would want to be, I'm a problem solver, chemical engineering seemed to be the one that encompassed all areas. You can, you can go into all the different types of disciplines relatively easily. So I worked my way. I was not the A-plus player, but I was able to matriculate with that degree. And from there, I had two offers getting out of school. One was a process engineer, and one was in a sales and marketing technical service. Well, I said if I went to the service side, I wouldn't do real hardcore engineering. So I did five years of that, and I realized that didn't give me enough face-to-face -face interactions. So I moved into a um, technical service role, which then grew into the parts where now I'm a North American business manager with, with Nordman. So I've been with the rubber division since 1998. I'm in an industry, and I was part of a major salt producer for a while, and one of the ways to get our product out there um, was to be a member of the rubber division and be at their expos, and that got me involved. So because it was a place for our business to be recognized, it was, you go to this expo. And I went to the expo, and I was a marketing person at that time, uh, selling technical grade products. The first year or two, it was an industry where a lot of people were there for a long time, but they didn't necessarily embrace. So I said, the one way to see if there's a success here is you've got to find a champion. And went out there and through the person that ran the expo, went up, met her one day, and she says, well, if you want to make a difference, get involved. So that brought me into getting onto the marketing and the exhibitions committees. And from those committees, there was sort of a natural evolution. And now I'm in rooms, I'm seeing one-on-ones talking to people within the industry. And now it becomes much more than an expo to me. It becomes a, a networking interface where I can make friends at the same time, learn from these folks around me and be able to grow my own knowledge as well as being able to partake in growing their knowledge. So my name is Anthony Marinello. And why am I proud to be a chemist? I'm proud to be a chemist because of the impact that I can have on the lives of those all around me. The successes that are created both from bench chemistry, process design, synthesis, as well as incorporating a large network where we can have global impact. And it can be as simple as helping a new company in a developing country to helping create the next level of regulation to make sure that the entire community is gonna be safe with the processes we create as well as things that can affect the long-term energy future of the country. So to be a chemist, you can do anything and you can touch anyone.